warning, this game is rated M for Mature. The commentary will likely not reflect this rating. However, you should still be aware of it yourself. This game also contains religious and gothic architecture that could be considered Christian or anti-Christian. You've been warned. If this makes you uncomfortable, feel free to not watch the video. A maniac. A maniac who otherwise I would not tr I would not trust the word of, but for the fact of the times that we live in. We're trying to track down a murder that may or may not have occurred. After going home to see our wife, all I can think of is is this really the kind of world we want to bring a family into? A world where the rich get richer and the wicked get away with their crimes because of their power? Nay, I say. We will be the ones to do justice if there is justice to be had. Ah, there is an important quest card guild for you. It's troublesome how there is always an important quest card at the guild for me, slowing me down, holding me back. I agree. Amanda? Yes, of course, I knew her. I think about her all the time. She was so beautiful, so pure. She was afraid her sister would find out about us and use it against her, stop her from becoming mayor. I'm no noble, after all. So, we'd meet in secret in the Grey House cellar. I would sneak out to the stables and flash my lamp three times to let her know I was there. One night, she didn't come out, and I found the cellar door locked. Her sister, Elvira, Lady Grey as she's now known, told me she had died of some terrible illness. Then the house was abandoned, and... I never even got to... I'm sorry. It's too painful to talk about. This reeks of foul play. Well, we all know ghosts are real. So let's see if we can't get this one to talk. No sense rushing. No sense rushing to find more pain in this impossibly haunted, impossibly evil house. Maybe there's a reason it's so sick and twisted. Maybe there's a reason the Grey House makes Five Nights at Freddy's look like Five Nights at McDonald's. Three flashes. There she is. Dead as the day 
she died. But how? I intend to find the truth. Unfortunately, the hero's work is never done. There's always more evil to deal with. Perhaps that's the true meaning behind these undead. Other victims of this so-called plague, or of Alvera Gray. Rodri, is that you? I've waited for you so long and I... Wait, you're not Rodri. I prayed that he would rescue me. But he never came. When the air ran out, I closed my eyes and imagined I was dying in his arms. Now I'll never see him again. And my sister has taken everything. People must know the truth about her. Take this letter. Show the world what really happened. I have no other intention. So, now you know the truth. Amanda was a weak, romantic fool. I do. She didn't have what it takes to run Bowerstone. She would have turned the whole place into an egalitarian slum. But don't worry your pretty head with such big words. We can still be together. You can still have me. Wouldn't you like to be mayor? Think of the power. It can all be yours. Just hand over the letter. The only thing keeping me from taking my bow out right now and ending you is the thought of you rotting away the rest of your life in a cell. What? No one refuses Lady Grey. No one. You're just like the rest of those imbeciles. I just Infecting did. my city with their petty little lives. Fine then. Tell everyone. Have your moment of glory. But I will return one day. And I will wash away all the filth with your blood. Remember that, hero. Is it too late to take out my bow? Don't forget this. Definitely don't. a borrowed card in this house somewhere. I'm sorry it had to end that way. I'm sorry no one was here to save you. searched this house last time because I was panicking from all the undead. What's not interesting? It's still working even though it's in that condition. A dusty notebook. What is that? A trophy. A bear. There are no bears in the land of Albion.
Well, there's only one thing left to do now. It's always hard telling people that somebody they cared about died. You know why I'd bother getting up in the and morning? It wasn't. You know the truth now. Bowerstone must be told. He said every day. It was a hot day. The flies stuck to the ground and walls like as if it were dung. Give it the atmosphere. That is very well what it meant. Unbelievable. Been. So get him was right all along. Well, I suppose we'd better release him. He'd better not start that nonsense about me spiking the water supply again, though. No? We'll have to find a new mare, too. <laughs> I don't suppose you'll be interested in the job. You have proved your worth after all. It's very important that you accept this. Oh, by the way, Noir Ninja deactivate. Because there's a lot of stuff inside the manor that you can only get to if you're the mayor. in Oakvale, though. 150 renown now that we are the mayor of Bowerstone. Which really is just a drop in the bucket for us. I'm going to go back there in a second. I want to see if Lady Grey's in the cell. Because that would be awesome. Sorry, she's not Lady Grey anymore. Now she's Alvera. Aww, that would have been a good touch. I like good touches. Don't read too much into that. Hello there, Sire. Ah, there is an important quest card of the guild for you. So you're the one they You can sponsor the guards break if you want to commit crimes. I completely forgot you could even do that because I do it so rarely. We're going to explore the manor. Then we're going to probably take that quest card but not do it just yet. Because I haven't done any silver key collecting or demon door opening for a while. Well, this place looks impossibly evil. Can we brighten it up, liven it up a little bit, make it a little happier? I know you can do that in Fable 3. Ooh, that's pretty. So now we know the truth. <coughs> Lady Grey <coughs> murdered her sister or Alvera Gray murdered her sister Amanda Gray. With a boat with likely a crossbow in the basement of her old house. Then fearing retribution, abandoned it. Say hello to the Katano Hiryu. The the Katano. The Katana Hiryu. This is our second legendary weapon. And being that it's a legendary sword, I will likely be using it in place of Wife's Blade. Or Jessica's, Jess, Jessica's Blade. 
Hey, that gave me evil points. Why did that give me evil points? This is my bed. I own this bed. And that was a silver key. That's dumb. How much gold do I have, I wonder? 30,000. Uh, yeah, no, I do not have enough to do a thing. Sometimes that confuses me. Why some things get you evil points and other things don't. Well, I'm calling shenanigans on that one. It was literally my house. Sorry for the pause there, guys. Or the break in commentary. I had to mark that silver key off my list, and we have 18 of the 30 silver keys. Two more, and we'll finally be able to open that tr silver key chest back at the guild. I've never found all the silver keys before. side quest. Certainly a lot more than the alternative. Marrying Lady Grey always felt kind of hollow. Where uncovering this murder not only adds a lot to the lore of Fable, but it also adds to the... Not only does it add a lot to the lore of Fable, but it adds a lot to the atmosphere of Bowerstone North and the Rose House. We know now possibly why it became haunted, why it was abandoned. And that's the kind of stuff in video games like this that I just eat up. Well, we have an important quest card. We have to take it so that they'll stop annoying us about it. But we're also going to take the Trader Rescue Quest. And I'm not going to boast because that's 5,000 good golds. We're going to do some side quests. We're going to do some side questing over the next couple episodes since we've been going pretty hard in the story paint for a while now. I really can't do that. Well, I guess we're going back to Oakvale. Could have swore there was a Cullet gate, Cullis Gate in the Bandit Camp. You know, it also might be a good idea to take care of the fist fighting leagues. Not this episode, because they're annoying. They take a lot of waiting, and if you screw up and you don't go all the way through, you have to wait again. Unless you have Moonfish. Which, even though I failed to use correctly last time I tried, allows you to skip to the next night. If I'm not mistaken, with Twin Blades rule ended, there shouldn't be any scouts out here anymore. Yep. Look at how much easier this is now. How much more fun and enjoyable. I'm going to equip the Katana Hiryu.
Ooh. It has the flame og, which will help us out against Hobbs, and a slashing og, or sharpening og, which will help us against everything. So it's an anti hob weapon. Okay, there's nobody here. I probably should have gone to... Not Witchwood, but... Not Whole Glade to see if they sold the golden armor. I think there is a vendor there that sells it. So we could get past this demon door, but I forgot. So instead we're gonna run. How much... This, this has been going on for about 20 minutes. The camera just rolled over. So we've got about 10 more minutes to go. Let's see if we can't finish this fest. I only took the story quest at the guild so the guild master would stop harassing me about it. Oh, I guess I also need to reopen that demon door in, uh... Near the Rose Cottage, too. You're here, sir. The situation is bad, sir, real bad. The bandits are demanding protection money from the traders' union and took three hostages to show they mean business. The union's refusing to pay up, even though today is the last day. They called me because I owed them a favor, but, well, I just got out of guard college last week and I only got a C minus in hostage recovery. <laughs> know what? I'll tell you where they are and leave you to it. Let me see. Uh, oh, yes, now there's uh, there's one's down the hill and uh, there's two more on the other side of them big gates. All clear? Right. I'm going to make a tactical withdrawal before they see me. All right. Uh, good luck. You're so delightly, delightfully helpless. And I'm pretty awesome, so we'll, we're good. Okay. Rescue all three of the traitors held captive in the bandit camp. I a scorn damn minute, you. You think of a <laughs> Why did it unlock? Why did it zoom in? probably shouldn't be using the bow as much because it's almost maxed out so I'm not I don't have much to gain from getting skill experience but darn it if it isn't just my best option this is easy Figuring out the controls. You guys do realize I just finished the arena. You're probably not going to be able to beat me. I'm just trying to clear out all the bandits first. I really don't need someone to watch my back. I really, really don't. I guess I can eat some meatuses. Let's pull out the sword, the Katana Hiryu, which has a very cool sounding, very Street Fighter-esque sounding name. Somebody should tell me what Hiryu actually means, because I'm fairly confident it's a Japanese word. You! You're from the guild! Rescued at last! Those bandits are a vicious bunch. You have to get me out. Ah! 
I'd stay there if I were you. You need someone to watch your... <laughs> I really don't need someone to watch my back. But I do appreciate just how stupid you are for continuing to ask when I've said no. That was dumb. Come on, Tartar. You're free to go. Fantastic. I'm over here. That's one trader down, two to go. Not so bad. Of course, this was the low level bandit camp. Next is the elite camp. That should prove quite a bit more challenging. In fact, if you have any questions on whether or not you can do it, I would actually recommend hiring the cell sword right here. To watch your back. Fortunately for me, we just I just finished the arena, so I don't think there's any problems. Enemy over there. No. I don't need someone to watch my back, but I do appreciate the offer. I'm good. I really, really am. Let's get the easy shot out of the way. See if I can't actually get this crosshair to move proper. Hey, the shooting gallery! the shooting gallery. I actually improved my abilities of shooting with the bow over the course of a game. Imagine that. They're still holding the fist fighting gang even with all this chaos going on? Props. I have every intention of getting you out. Stop nagging me. Nagging is not a way to get out of trouble faster. There! Fully healed! Thank you, heal life. and I'll follow you. Ah, my savior! You have come to rescue me, haven't you? Why, yes, I have. Ah, excellent. It's just that sometimes you... Uh, Guild types uh, like to chop our heads off instead. <clears throat> anyway, uh, let's go. I can relate to that. I definitely have known a lot more people to play as evil characters than good. Even though almost everybody plays good at first, because... I have forgotten my sense of direction. It must be right here. Well, this wasn't so bad. It's not over yet. I shouldn't be getting cocky. Oh, 
Well, that was challenging. I'm not complaining, by the way. I know this episode's going on for a little longer. <coughs> but with load times, I don't really know how much longer. No. But with load times and all that, I don't actually know exactly how much longer it's going to take. So I'm just going to... You know, this quest isn't all that exciting. I guess I'll speed up through the rest of it. Two trainers down, one to go. I just said trainer. It's not what I meant. Let's rescue the last trader. Back to speed up. Precious time. You have no idea how long I've been waiting to be rescued. We can't stand here all day talking, though. We gotta leave now. At least on that, we're agreed. I know this episode's gonna go a little bit over the 30 minute mark, some of them do, but we finished the mission, or at least we will have soon. I've been trying to use mostly my will and melee powers for the rest of this mission. This is just the best spell. Well, it's not slow time. It's the best one that's not completely broken. Instead, it's just mostly broken. And after doing it, man, it's gonna only take one hit. Victory! I will be blessed. I'm safe. Pardon my abruptness earlier. I didn't mean to be ungrateful. You have Thomas Merchant III's heartfelt gratitude. Yep, we got us some gold, some experience, and a little bit of renown. Well, that's it for today. I've been Ninja X the Enlightened Gamer. Until the next time, as always, stay enlightened. Hello, Ninja X here. Thank you so very much if you've made it this far in the video. I appreciate your newer continued support greatly. However, if you want to want to increase your support, you should consider subscribing if you haven't already, or check out some of my other content on this channel via the annotated links on the screen, which will take you to my most recent Let's Play, my current side Let's Play, and my vlogs playlist, three things that I do on this channel. If you are from Lionhead Studios and you're checking this video to see if it should be taken down, 
please, I strongly, strongly encourage you not to. I have not, I will not monetize any of these videos containing your music or your images. I do have a tip jar on my channel, but that is purely for my commentary and purely extra if my fans should so consider choosing supporting me further than is beyond what I would require them to. The tip jar is not a necessity. It's purely extra. And though they will be rewarded with inside information for leaving tips, it's not a requirement. Anyways, until next time, as I've already said, stay enlightened.